Okay. I want to talk about one thing because I was trying to do something. I was trying to do something. I was trying to increase or decrease my font size in Zoom. Like, for example, when you go to annotate and you go over here to draw, you have a font size. But the problem was I had accidentally pressed something to increase that font size. And I had accidentally pressed central and the plus button. And then you can increase to 120, to 150, to 180. If it's at 180, your smallest font's going to be this. And that's really going to cause a problem in your classroom. So what you want to do is you want to be able to decrease that central minus down to it can put it all the way down to 80 actually. And I was and uh, let's put it down to 100. That's the size you want. It also affects your chat room your chat room font. If you do central plus, it'll make it bigger. You know, hello. And it's not a lot of fun. Not what works for me in the class. I like to have it at 100. Um, and then, you know, normal size. And also when I work with the annotate button, it needs to be this size. You could underline text and stuff. I, I can't have it being this size or even any size bigger than this. So the problem was I was trying to Google how to do that. And every time I put Zoom program font size, I would get other stuff. And it was driving me crazy, and I was clenching my fist, and I was screaming, and I was just going crazy. So that's how you do it. Central plus to increase the font size. Central minus to decrease the font size. All right. That's all. Man, I was going crazy. Well, man, got to go back here, and I got to go back to my meeting. Well, I could just mouse button. And stop recording.